Hey everyone, and welcome to the uh, the Sims 3 Generations. And obviously, this isn't a new. I don't start with this screen normally. I'm just resetting the town. I'm just showing proof, um, just in case. I just I don't know. I feel like you know, just being truthful and just it, it doesn't really matter. I know, but like you know, just so you can see that you know that you know it didn't take too long. Literally took a couple of seconds. But um, I just was do it sat there and I just decided to just start it. So um, everyone should be reset, I guess. I don't know. And yeah, it was just getting really laggy, and I just felt like you know the game needed a little bit of a reset just because, just for any glitches and stuff. You know what I mean? Actually, it's I don't know if it's laggy, but hopefully that's fixed because it's been getting gradually more laggy throughout the game. Um, my plan is to give them a little, um, both of them actually, a little um, overhaul because Darla, she just realised that like, it is a holiday place but she's indoors looking after the kids most of the time so I feel like she would be inclined to kind of just change her outfit just to kind of, so she's a bit more comfortable just indoors a bit more because at the moment she's stuck indoors and um, wearing it's a nice clothes very nice clothes i like what she's wearing but um just to be a little bit more casual and comfortable at home because that's where she is most of the time so um i'm gonna do this on camera just so you can kind of <laughs> pink I don't, I don't know if that's her style um i don't really like the thing down the side i don't mind the writing but that picture i'm not too happy about Oh, so there's like that one, um, and then let's just make it like grey, you know how, you know, the sweatpants that everyone wears, kind of that, kind of, if I can actually do it, like, yeah, mm. and then this is the writing, I'm guessing, no, I don't know, what's this changing, I have no clue, so I'm just going to put it white, that's what I always do, or black or something, I just... I don't have a clue what it's changing. Maybe it's the little straps at the top because it looks like it has little straps. But then we're just going to put on a little casual top. Um, just to make, just because she's like, you know, in like jean shorts and like a top. I don't know. I feel like sweatpants would be way more comfortable than some jeans. So we're going to definitely just give her a little bit of a... And he doesn't care. Like she want, He wants her to be as comfortable and stuff and he wish he was at home but he's getting that money you know so and I want to put her in bare feet but she is going to go out and actually I cannot be able to change her um so if she does go out she'll just have to wear this which I mean like I don't I, I don't judge anyone and I think anyone that wears stuff like this they're clearly just going out to get a little something or maybe it changed the top bit here but um, maybe they're just going out just just to get some milk or something, you know, nothing, you know, you don't need to get dressed all the time, like, I go out looking like a part of shit, like, 90% of the time, um, so, yeah, the only time I do get dressed is to go to college, and sometimes I go out looking, going to college like shit as well, so, and then we're gonna go change him, he's, um, not, there's nothing wrong with his outfit at all, but I just felt like, you know, it'd be cool to do both of them, and, um, also, I kind of want to get the dye out of her hair because it goes on the children, but um, I feel like because he the baby came out blonde because he's actually a blonde. He's actually a blonde. But let's just say he doesn't like blonde. And he doesn't like being blonde. It makes him look um, like a boy toy. And he doesn't, he doesn't like that. So he likes the kind of dark hair. Um, yeah, he's a fan. Of, he just likes dark hair. So, uh, so we don't need to do much with him but his career he's wearing bare feet which I am not happy with at all it's not acceptable I know he's a lab rat but like come on um so we definitely gotta get his feet covered like what the hell is going on so he's a lab rat so I don't know really what um that is cute as fuck I'm not even gonna that makes him look like he's a cadet or like some like military guy that's so freaking cute um but He's work. He's a lab rat. I don't know if he got a promotion. Promotion. We we'll just literally just go casual. We we'll just go casual. But the shoes are the main thing. Um. 
But now he's got kids, I feel like, you know, he kind of looks a bit of like an emo goth. Not full on, but just, you know, he's wearing dark clothes. Um, so, uh, but I think now he's got kids, he's kind of lightening up a bit more and becoming more of that daddy um, looking role. Um, yeah, he's got a job, he's got beautiful kids. You know, I feel like he's kind of, you know, a bit more, what do you call it? I don't know, I don't know what you call it, but he's a bit more, he still likes black and he still likes dark hair, but I feel like he's, um, he's, he's kind of changing a bit, which is cool, but he's still himself. Um, but I might change his hair back blonde if, um, and you guys probably, the ones that have like tuned in from the beginning, he wasn't ending the thumbnail, he's not blonde in the thumbnail or anything like that. Um, it's a long story, well it's not really, but, um, when I was making these characters he was originally blonde, but then I changed him to brown, this one right here, and I was like, oh he's gonna be brown. But then the kid came out blonde, which made me think that maybe, actually, he's still kinda blonde underneath, which I don't actually know how that happened, but anyways, um, yeah, so I just, he dyed his hair, this colour, brown, that's what we're gonna say, so. Uh, so I wanted to put some shorts on him, but um, yeah, that's what we're gonna say. And um, no, that's what's happened. Yeah, like that's what's happened now. That's the that's the the story now. So um, no, that was always the story. It was planned. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna put some shorts on him. And what the? Oh, this is supernatural. We don't want to go here. But yeah, this is a bit more lighter. I really like how he's just lining up a bit, but he's got his tattoos of his um, children, Smidge and... Oh my gosh. Hayden. Hey, oh my gosh. No, it's not Hayden. It's... Oh. I'm shit with names. I really am. Um, Smidge and... Dayton, is it? Hayden. I think it's Hayden. I'd... I think it's Hayden. Like, you know I'm crap with names. But, um, yeah, it was really cute, um, just to, just to remind you guys that that's, you know, still there, if you forgot, because I kind of did a bit, Smidge and Hayden, yeah, so, I, yeah, that's, that's something I wanted to do, clear the town and give them a little bit of a makeover thing, so, that's all good, so, I think he came from work in the last part, and we witnessed a death, which wasn't cute at all, um, and we wanted to go here, didn't we? Yeah, but that didn't happen. We'll go there in a sec. We'll go there in like two seconds. But she wants to... Oh, it's so cute. Like, she's a mother now and all that. It's so cute. It's always cute. It's always cute seeing like a, a sim. Like, turn into a mother. Like, before she was just like hanging out with a boyfriend on holiday. Remember the first episode with the date night and stuff? And now she's like got kids and she's in her sweats. Like, it's so cute. Um, I don't know if she just run along right now. Oh no, she wants to see her other kid. But I don't know if she should run along and go and see the next door neighbours. And if you remember in the last part, she was actually a friend, I think. Where is she? I think she, it was her or something that lives in that house. Um, so he already knows her. And I was thinking that they could be kind of like best friends kind of thing. So we're just going to try it again and go here. Naomi, is that the girl? Is that the girl that I'm on about? Naomi. Yep, so that's her. Hopefully we'll get to know her soon. But at the moment, that doesn't, that doesn't seem to be happening. But anyways, we're just gonna... Has he got work? Has he got work? Work. Okay, yeah, he's got work. So, you know, it's the middle of the week kind of thing. It's only Tuesday. So, yeah, it's nearly, they're nearly Wednesdays in the middle of the week. And so he's gonna be working and she's gonna be looking after the children. So does he wanna talk to her? No. Oh, girl, 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 girl. Just feed him. Just feed him on the floor. Feed him on the floor. There we go. So, what else was I thinking of doing? I normally, I just turn on this game and I don't really plan much. Um, the only things I planned was to give them a little, mm, little overhaul and to reset the town. That's literally it. And, um, 
I've done that now, so I think we're just gonna, I don't know if we should like, we've got a bit of money, I don't really want to spend it just as, uh, just right off the bat, because I know that <clears throat> when I do that, I, or when I spend, when I get money in the sims, and then I spend it, I afterwards I always regret it because I've got no money, but, so I'm not gonna, I'm gonna with, withhold myself from um, spending any money right now, but I can't wait for them to age up, um, <laughs> Um, where, how far are they from aging up? Let's have a look. So they're going to age up in two days, which is really close. Um, and then the family tree. Oh, just, just a little cute. And then, are they engaged to anything? I don't think they are. They're not? No. I feel like, the sh oh, I feel like something should happen. I feel like something should happen. Ooh. 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 I feel like he could just propose like here and it would be really sweet anyway. So I think we're gonna we're gonna do it. Like maybe he's planning it. Right now he's rocking in a chair and the kids aren't even there, so he's not watching anything. So I think he's thinking about it, so Ooh. Because, I mean, for ages, they have been, like, kissing and, like, without me doing anything. Oh, my God. It's so cute. Just walking around. It's just, like, literally, girl, you don't have to wash it up or anything. Um, I can. So, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. So, she's in her sweatpants. It's not ideal. But he don't give a fuck what she's wearing. He loves this girl. To the, the moon and back, so. We're not, we haven't gone anywhere. Um, I ain't, we don't have to pay for a babysitter, do we? We're gonna stay here. Ooh, no, 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 girl. Girl. Just come here. This is gonna be, no. Uh, come here, come here. Go here. Okay, just call a babysitter. Let's get this show on the road. So, there's a little lamppost thing. So, we're gonna have a heat at the moment kiss thing. So, if the lighting's a bit dark, I I can barely see as well. Just about. Um, wait, okay. So, we're gonna see if we can get that. Um, <clears throat> sorry about that. See if we can get them to propose. Take a romantic photo. Why not? Why not? Oh, Stroke cheat. Let's just get these things flowing. And I want to get this selfie. Mo oh my god, that's so fucking. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. I'm just done. Physically done with life. I'm done. Oh, look at her, her little booties. They don't even look like Uggs, they just look like boots. So cute. I'm done. Is that too close? I don't like getting the speech bubbles in. Okay, we'll get a little one out. There we go. Um, play, play. Cute. Cute. So we need to get this proposal on the road right now. Uh, come on. Where do we? So I think we just have to keep doing romantic stuff, or is it in special? Got me done. Tell a dirty <laughs> joke. Uh, come on, I don't have all day. Literally, am I gonna have to skip out to get this thing? Pros marriage. Okay. Girl, like, get the fuck away from me, please. Oh, uh, my gosh. Rude. Like, I'm sorry, but if she's a neighbor, we haven't spoke to any neighbors, and every time we want to knock on a door, no one's home. Now we're trying to propose. It's 10 o'clock at night, and we got this bitch just... You've got the whole walkway, honey. You've got the whole walkway. Just, just walk along, please. I hope she goes. I'm done. I'm done. She's not gonna go. Ringa? 
She's like, I want to go through there. <laughs> like, I want to go through there and you're blocking my way. And it's just like, yeah, there's no space anywhere else. This is really frustrating. Oh, my gosh. But, I mean, it's so dark, so we're not going to take a screenshot anyways. Uh, oh, my God, her hair goes short. I don't know if you guys know this, her hair goes short. If it goes... Okay, so they are now engaged. It's really cute. We didn't even know it was happening, but he's planning it on his own. Oh my gosh, she just wanted to see. Okay, maybe she just wanted to see, but she was stamping her foot, like, tapping her foot, like, get the fuck out of the way. Um, I feel like we should do something. Like, she's rebellious, dramatic. He's a dead. So I think she would be the one to be like, like, honey, congratulations, I don't know, engage, can get married at a party, or prefer something a little more intimate. So I think we'll go for it in a more intimate thing when the, she wants to join the political career. So we're not even going to go there, we're just going to give her a rude little introduction, because she's a little, she ruined it. Discovered the vast digital world of social networking, from texting, blogging, customizing, or something. No, we don't want him getting into that shit. He's got his family. He don't need a phone. Or well, he doesn't need a smartphone. Although they get smartphones anyways, but... Oh my god, we have to pay. Oh, it's not too much, but still. We have to pay, and I didn't want to pay. Because we're just outside. We might as well have gone somewhere. But she's, like, tired, and she's... F she's, like, flattered. She's, like, I'm flattered. By everything that he does, and he's just amazing. Don't leave them down here, no. Don't. His energy's low, so come and pick up our little smidgy boo. Is he in bed? Yeah, he is. And then come bring smidge in the crib. So yeah. Oh, I just love the toddlers. I just like toddlers are life. And I just love the little socks and his little feet. Mm. So did we get a picture? Did we get a picture? We didn't get a picture. So they just took it. It wasn't like a picture that we could get. Is that what I'm... Okay. So he's cracked his phone. He's a proper boy. Like, oh, I just dropped my phone. <laughs> um, Throw a bachelor rep. I hate it when it does that. I'm just like, I don't know if I want to throw one. Yeah, we'll definitely throw one. It's just, does it cost money? I don't know. But I think we're going to plan a bachelorette party and a bachelor dip, uh, party train. Have we not party trained? Shit. A bachelorette party. So she wants to get married. Obviously that's happening. Which one gives us more? Because I want to get rid of one. Oh, they give us the both. I want to keep both of them. Snuggle Hayden. That's not going to give us much. So we're going to we're gonna have a bachelorette party. And we're going to have a bachelor party. So take a, we haven't got a bath. Yeah, we're going to throw one. Um, I think we'll do it in the next part. I think this part's been really short, actually. <laughs> I... Well, I, I think having a bachelorette party is quite soon. And we've got kids, so I don't feel like having a bachelorette party is wise when we've got kids. Oh, look. Oh, my gosh. The, he's thinking of marriage. Ah, oh, these two just get me constantly on a daily basis. They just their relationship just slays <coughs> the Sims literally. Pick up Hayden. Literally, they're just needless things. She wants to throw a birthday party. Oh, I cancelled it. Um, but yeah, we've got to throw a birthday party, so we kind of need, and we'll film it as well on the little camera thing here. But um, oh, and he's thinking of her. Stop. <laughs> We need to throw a birthday party, so that's also more money there. And he's thinking of her, and he's like, I want to work out. And so we just see what they're thinking for a little bit. Let's park bench. So that's kind of like a calming thing. Oh, and she's married as well, them two. And then, because he uh, works at a lab, he's like... And then she wants to do politics, like... Loads of things go through your mind. I wonder, maybe this is dreams. So what dreams could they be? Oh my gosh, she's thinking of him. Um, okay, this is probably so boring for you to watch. So, um, let's cut out in the morning. 
and I don't know if anything's gonna happen, but we'll see, you never know, we might visit the vampire girl, so, um, uh, I'll see you then. Hey guys, it's currently 7 o'clock, just turned 7 o'clock in the morning, and... The carpool will come for chat in uh, about an hour, so let's get your ass out of bed and let's just have a shower, you know, just just make sure you're all clean for the day and then we'll get a little quick serving of cereal, 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 so and she waking up soon, she looks like she's going to wake up soon and the baby is up. Hayden, I believe it's up, yeah, and he's a bit hungry, so let's get Darla up, and I wish you could breastfeed on this game, yeah, that would be nice, if you could, like, yeah, breastfeed, so I think today we're gonna, um, I don't know if I'll show this on camera, I don't know, I like to show everything though, but I don't want it to get too boring, but I want to potty train them because I was wondering, I was like, we teach them to talk and walk, I think, so I was like, they swear there's something else, but it's because the potty was upstairs, we didn't have the option to do that, so are they both hungry? Yep, so we're going to get them both to feed, get their feed, but yeah, we should keep breastfeed because I love it on The Sims um, 4, um, I love that feature, but um. Because I think their breasts get bigger when they're pregnant, but they can't actually breastfeed, so it's kind of like, I bet there's a mod, though. I 100% think there's probably a mod, but I don't really, it's not like, I'm not like, oh my gosh, why, you know, I can live without it, and it doesn't really bother me. So, um, has he gone to work yet? Has he not? Oh, he's edit, which is great, and he's got his new outfit on, which is a lot more appropriate. Um... So yeah, do, do, do. so she's gonna, when well, she's going upstairs to use the fridge, we've got to pay our bills, only 80 for simoleons, which is like absolutely nothing, so I think we'll, she wants to go for a stroll, oh, cause she wants to do so many things, she wants to have a water balloon f fight, I can't wait for the kids to be older because we can do so much more, and as a good mother she's just bringing him down, she's just gonna bring him down because, you know, just because. She wants him closer. She can't have him upstairs on his own. And then she's going to go sort herself out now. So we should put like a little window here. So she can see into the living room. Should we do it? It's weird. It's kind of weird. But I want to do it. Oh my god. I, it's weird isn't it? To do that in the house. It's, it's like what you have at like restaurants and stuff. Uh, so we just want like a little. That No definitely not. It's just a little bit too small. That's quite big, but... No, that's too big. That's too big. So let's open this up and just get a whole selection here. Can we move this up? Oh, no, okay. This one. That's giant. That's literally giant. Yeah, that looks... That's kind of artsy at the same time. It looks, it does look like a canteen, like with the kind of shutters, not a fan of that, that's the one we just had, I feel like there's not going to be one, and that's literally like a window window, it might be kind of quirky, I'm not sure, mm. struggling, struggling, I'm just picking the same ones now, aren't I? Ooh, uh, this one. That's pretty cute because you can open it. I think that's so cute. <laughs> so you'd open it that way, definitely. Um, obviously, you probably wouldn't actually open it, though. But I don't know if you move the couch over underneath. Or would it whack your head? Okay, so we're just going to go with that. I don't want to spend too much money again when I get carried away and I start spending money. Like... I just go crazy. So that's a little cute window. I think it's really cute. <laughs> it's a little cute quirky feature. I love little things like that just uh, to give the house kind of its personality and just kind of instead of just a basic box, you know, just some little cute things like that. I think that's really cute. So um, like I said, I wanted to give the babies um, potty training. So we're going to go ahead and do that right now. And... 
before after no, after she eats after she eats obviously she wants she's getting so many um wishes and stuff so annoying so we're gonna ha go ahead and do that now party train we're gonna go for hayden i think which one was the more brainy one okay it doesn't really matter uh, we don't favor any anyone over the other so we just just keep on doing it party train hayden Come on, just get this done, and then I'll end the part, and, oh, no, 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 we want to see, um, Naomi, is she over there right now? Survivalist, household, well, that sounds, sounds scary, um, so, yeah, we're gonna go see her after this, after this, so, uh, I kind of want to cut out, because I'm just literally doing the same thing over and over again, I doubt anything's gonna happen so I'm gonna go and if something happens obviously I'll show you but I'm gonna go ahead and cut to when we I'm done with all this and we'll go and see our little Nomi Nomi baby which we haven't met yet oh it's raining oh no it's hailing Ooh. okay so oh, we're gonna we're gonna go I'll cut back when we're gonna see Nomi okay see you then okay guys we're, we haven't finished party training but Chet's just consumed an experimental sub substance and is feeling weird. <sighs> I hope he gets paid extra for this. I really do because oddly powerful. Okay, that doesn't seem too bad. Iron f Chet could, sta could stand a few hours of fun to iron out the stress. He's stressed, strained. An oddly powerful, so I have no clue what this means. Um, I hope he doesn't die. I mean, I can't see it dying, but you never know. You never know. So just potty training now, potty training. He's nearly done. So he's left to work with 221. So we've got Hayden potty training. And look at all this mess. We're gonna go ahead and mop up this puddle. So you can use it freely now, which is really cool. And check, can you go ahead and just empty this for us, you little babe? So he's feeling what I think he'll be alright. He'll be alright. So we're gonna go ahead and pot potty train. Smidge, because he's the last one. Um But maybe he can invite over this Naomi girl, because she clearly doesn't seem to be in much. So we're gonna go ahead and do that now. Invite over. So hopefully we can get this done before she comes up. Nah, she doesn't feel like coming over. I don't know. Maybe she's like a um a homebody. We're all I'm a homebody, I like staying at home. So I I feel you girl. But maybe she just doesn't want to come over. Maybe she just doesn't like kids, whatever. She doesn't have to come over, but we're gonna go ahead and just finish this, and we hope, I hope he won't die. He's feeling oddly powerful, which, to me, seems catch three fish. We did go fishing at one part, so we might do that. Um, but yeah, he looks like it. he took in substance that was actually beneficial, so that's good to know. Um, I feel like I'm torturing these kids, just like, come on, just sit back on it like poop it out like push it out come on i know you just pooped just two seconds ago but just push another one out just push it out push what was that money was it he's cooking oh look at you all domesticated and stuff um so we have play trained both of the toddlers so they are fully like developed i guess you could say and we're gonna go ahead and mop up this mess um, I think I'm going to end this part here. It's been a, a little chill part again. Um, oh, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? You are, you are, you are. Lee. Oh, he's paparazzi. So, yeah, the woman that died there, she was the non-celebrity and then she was living with a celebrity. Um, anyways, I'm going to end this part here. I hope you guys enjoyed it and... Leave your suggestions on like any like story like I really do need like kind of suggestions with like what should happen and stuff because 
Like, I always see people's suggestions on other people's, like, videos, like, Deli and, um, uh, Sim Sugar and stuff, and, like, I just think people can be so creative, and even Urban Sims, yeah, her as well, people leave comments of story suggestions, and I think it's really cool, and I would really love some help, so, you know, if you want to, just leave it in the comment section below, and I'll definitely check it out, so, I'm gonna end this part here, like I said, a thousand times, and I'll see you in the next part, bye guys!